Hello food tubers, how are you doing? Welcome to the Jamie Show. It's Bathford. Yeah, well yeah. In the sorted kitchen where we are going to knock up a really cheap dish with fish and then we're going to do braised celery. That's different. Very underused ingredient. Yeah. Some new potatoes crushed with a few herbs and a great tomato side of sauce. Okay, so to start off with our celery, all you need to do is crack off the uh, pieces of celery from the root. I wonders where you were going. There. And <laughs> peel it. Now, some people don't like to shut up. <laughs> some people don't like to peel celery, but I think, especially this stringy stuff, it's worth getting it out of the way. I'm really going to very lightly braise these, so we want to get rid of as much as that's possible. Potatoes, bog standard, great this time of year, in season. They're going to go into our pan of salted water. Now, this particular dish is probably one of the cheapest we're going to do on Food Tube. We managed to get this down to less than £1.50 a portion. Wow. So, a whole balanced meal for less than you'd pay for a posh cup of coffee. Yeah, and more nutritionally good for you. Fact. Once the celery is all cut up, a drizzle of oil into our pan. That can all go in there, Jamie. Yeah. And we're just going to start to sort of fry and saute those off. Okay. Medium high heat. And to it, we're going to add a few other flavours. Two cloves of garlic, if you can peel and crush those. Yep. Either dried ingredients you can have in your cupboard, store cupboard to kind of use whenever you want, or great if you can pick them straight from the garden. Even more cost effective to have a few, a thyme bush and a bay leaf tree. There we go. Grow a money tree. And then you wouldn't have to worry. There is that. So that's our celery, garlic, thyme, bay leaf. At this point, a good time to season up salt and pepper. And we'll give that a couple more minutes. Now, talk about our fish. Yes, what have we got? Fish for? is not a cheap ingredient. No. Often there are very expensive fish around, but if you buy carefully, you can get pollock or a coli. Very, very cheap. So we're looking at about 80 pence a portion for this. This is white fish. As you bought it frozen. Right. Okay, and then just let it defrost, and all we're going to do is drain that off, season it. So if you can salt and pepper those. Yeah. We'll get this pan on and up to temperature as well. At this stage, the celery has started to cook. It's not done yet, but now is a good time to add in our tomato passata. So you okay. can buy it in a carton or yep. a tin. Again, nice cheap ingredients that always hang around when you need them. Add a glass of that in there, and that's it. The dish is pretty much there. All we'll do right at the end is put a little dash of cream in, just to enrich it, last thing. The fish going in, what I've done is kept them folded over. Oh, okay, yeah. And cooking it as one, it's a meatier piece of flesh. Okay, okay so it's a cheap bit of fish, you do something clever with, and you get a better end product. Fold it in half. Fold it in half. Turn our board over, you just chop up some fresh chives. Yes. And I'm going to drain off our potatoes. So these have been bubbling away for about 15 minutes, perfect for new potatoes. This really is the perfect kind of dinner for midweek, isn't it? You don't want to give it too much thought during the day. You don't want to give it too much thought whilst you're actually doing it in the evening. You just want to eat it quickly. Yep, and it's, it's nutritious cheap. as well. Yeah. That we're keeping all the skins on those potatoes. I'm not mashing them, just kind of crushing them. That's enough. Plenty of oil, salt and pepper, and your chives. Yep. And that's that dish done. So that's done. At this point, we'll give our fish a quick flip. And then at about the same time on the other side, Finishing touches to our tomato and braised celery. Say it's braised, it's only been very, very quickly cooked. Should still have a slight bite in it. Yep. It's a glove of cream. Lovely. Bit of a stir. Or a swill. Or a swill. You could do in that. Less washing up. Taste that. That's nice. Simple, speedy food. Good to serve up already. Finishing touches, a squeeze of lemon over our fish. We've cooked enough fish for two, but the whole dish, the whole recipe, you can get available at sortedfood.com. That'll be enough for four. It makes it even cheaper for portion if you're cooking for four in at 125. Use the same lemon we've squeezed to put a little wedge on there. Waste less. Serve up a piece of our fish and finish it with those last few chives. Scrape it off the board. There we go. Use Very it. simple, quite summary dish with fish, crushed new potatoes, and braised celery. Sorted. It's one of those dishes you kind of need a little bit of everything on the fork. I wish you got potato at that time. And although it's a cheaper cut of fish, flakes really nicely. That really is good. Just like a fish finger, without breadcrumbs. It doesn't matter what celery you're earning, you should be eating this. Boom. And if you do want to eat this, then make sure you get all the recipe and ingredients from our website, which is food.com. Make sure you're subscribed to FoodTube, and if you want to see more of our ugly mugs, then head over to Sorted Food as well. Perfect. <laughs>